Hi everyone, this is an idea of what to do when you've made a page with a specific design and then you only have one photo left. So for this page I had these four small photos and I wanted to try out um, this page design of using um, the alternate squares with embellishment. But what I found is that I had this photo left over, which I wanted to include because we were both in it, but there was no room left on this page. And I really didn't like the idea of making an entire um, another 12 by 12 page um, just for this one photo. And the other reason was that everything fits on nicely in the book because this is a continuation of the same day. So what I ended up doing was um, making a 6 by 12 sheet and just putting it in a page protector and then trimming it down and then if you can see here I've just stitched along it and I've just left my ends there so it's obvious that it has been stitched. So one of the things that you will need to take into consideration with this though is how it looks next to your other pages because now I can see this page, my half page and I can also see the page behind it. So what I chose to do was um, use a totally different paper that used the same background so it's using a cream instead of a white which is the same as this and tones in well with the craft color. Then I've used match the paper so this is a, um, a grid by basic grey and I've matched it to a grid back here and then I've used the same paper on the other side so this is all toned through and then toned back with this um, cream colour back through there and I've got some of the cream colour on this page as well. So um, then all I had to do was find another photo that would work in with this page that I'd done to put on this side and it just happened that I had these smaller photos and a big um, normal size 3x4 photo so I put that on the other side and I think that that worked quite well.